Hello everybody, I'm Andy. I'm in the base room at Tolman with Julia. Hi everyone. And I'm a little bit scared because we're kind of <laughs> debating. It started out as, as a discussion. We turned the camera on and it's now turned into a debate and slash argument. Yes. Are, we, are we arguing yes. right now? A little bit. Okay. Um, we were talking about what is groove. And I said that groove is the sort of thing that's uh, provided by the rhythm, rhythm section. section. And I said... Okay, yes, the rhythm section, cool, but groove is in every music, like, do you know, I'm coming from Austria, and we've got, in Viennese, we've got the waltz, and it also has kind of groove and melody, and this groove you can learn by heart, I would say, like you have got a sheet, and you exactly have to play on that bar, and uh, you have to feel it. And that's why I thought, no, it's not just the rhythm section. Groove could be in every music. Okay. Can you groove on an ocarina? Of course. <laughs> okay, so my, my uh, argument is moot. Uh, I'm, I'm more than willing to say that I'm wrong. We're trying to, what we're trying to do is, is just define what groove is without being music theorists, because we're not. So it's really hard to define something that I would say is a feeling, right? We're both, we agree that it's a feeling. It's a feeling, yeah. And we, we've got some guitars with, I've got this rather lovely gold strat and, and you've got, what have you got, a 64 Journeyman Relic? Oh, and that's so beautiful. Pewter P bass? It feels so good. Um, but yeah, you, you just said it, it doesn't matter what notes you're playing. Mm. The groove is so important. I think when, example when you are improvising and the groove for bass player for me especially is everything because when I lose the groove I'm like oh my god <laughs> then I'm lost so can you play the wrong notes and still be groovy yes yes okay so what before we shot this video we were sort of planning it believe it or not and um, <laughs> we were trying to play without groove and we can't which doesn't make us great musicians. It's just, <laughs> no. I, was, I was giving examples, like if I, if I like, I'm gonna play on the beat. Yes, and I told him that's still groove. That's it, that is groove, you, yeah. I mean, I was dancing and that and everything, but I, the plan was to put a metronome on and play strictly with the beat, because we have kind of agreed that we defined groove as something that's not entirely accurate, like a computer. No, no. Yeah. Are we agreeing on that one? Yes, yeah. It's, okay kind of feeling so and I, especially when people are starting to dance so i think that then you know you've done a great job okay <laughs> and i'm sure watching this you're all amazing dancers and when that groove starts you can't help but hit the dance floor just like me <laughs> and um do the the dad dance you know where maybe only the top half moves and the bottom half doesn't are you going to play something oh no no, no. Not, not now but, okay um, yeah i am i will but Let's talk about what it isn't, groove isn't. So it's not about a computerized, accurate drum beat, like tack, 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 tack. So when, if you're making music with computers and you quantize everything, can it still be groovy? Yes, because you can program those exact moments, but you have to really go into subdivisions and really get in, in, in on the grid and, and really program that. But standard quantizing won't be groovy or is less groovy help me out but do we have to fix that no what i'm trying to say i guess is that if you're making music with computers and i do i make drum tracks with yeah. with i don't i'm not a drummer i don't own a drummer you know i don't keep one at home as a pet so i have to run on a computer and often quantize my drum tracks of their program but then they lose their humanity so there's software that sometimes have a humanized button. It's too exact. Too exact, yeah. Okay. Too robotic. So if you press the humanize button on, on whatever software I'm using, yeah. it slightly makes it slightly wrong, I guess, is the right word. Okay. But by being wrong, it's groovy. So do you want a groove? I want a groove. You want to show some groove? Yeah. Okay, let's da lay down some groove. And... If you're watching this maybe on the toilets or in the train or wherever you are watching this, <laughs> wherever you do your YouTube viewing, try not to dance to this. Okay, we're going to set a challenge. There we are. Try okay. not to groove. You start. 
Oh, thanks. Um... But that was that we did rehearse that slightly, didn't we? Just to you know, we didn't just rip that out of nowhere. But that was groovy. Was that groovy? Comment down below. Was that groovy? Help us out Sometimes. here. Sometimes we've made a video about what is groove, and we don't know what groove is. But that had groove. So, Julia, how do you define what groove is? We need I... we need Adam Neely here. I think. Oh yes, we need Adam, Adam Neely. Adam Neely, please here. help us. <laughs> <laughs> Please come and define what groove is in a way that humans can understand. For me, it's a feeling. Groove is a feeling. Okay. And you can't really teach that well. So it's really um, difficult to teach what groove is when you don't feel it in your heart or if, yeah, that's really difficult, I think. Okay. Well, yeah, we all have our own kind of natural metronome. It's, it's the heart and the heartbeat. And, and to get really deep now, that's where music comes from, the heart. And I don't know what I'm trying to say. I am trying to say that groove <laughs> is a feeling. We can agree on that. Yes. It started as a sort of argument where you've started smiling towards me. So I'm, I'm quite happy now. <laughs> Comment down below on what you think groove is and maybe what groove isn't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and. Let us know what you think. Sorry for not answering the question in the title of the video, but uh, <laughs> I had a lot of fun and I got to play a gold strat. So I'm happy. Julia, thank you so much yeah, for your time. Thanks. And um, off camera, try not to kill me too much. <laughs> Bye. Right. Bye, everybody. <laughs>